guys welcome back to my channel my name is Jay and if you're seeing me for the first time you're welcome please feel free to join the family and subscribe so on this channel I talk about skincare skincare tips and some natural DIY so on today's video I'll be talking about um, products for dark skin if you are dark skin caramel skin hot chocolate this video is for you there are some products that you can use to maintain that glow. If you're dark and you want to go from dark to chocolate, there are some lotion you can use to achieve that color. So today we are talking mainly about our dark skin girls, our brown skin girls. Not every time whitening is whitening. So today is mainly for dark skin girls. So let's dive right into the video. So sorry, I'll be looking down and I'll be posting the pictures up here for you to see the product. So I'll be looking down because I'll be reading the name from my list. I have a list of 10 good products that you can apply as a dark skin lady, as a chocolate skin, as a brown skin, as a melanin skin. So stay tuned. So the number one on my list is on Authentica. I'll be leaving the picture up here so that you can see how it looks like. So number one on my list is Authentica. Authentica is a very good lotion and it's an old lotion. It has been in the market for a while now, for a long time I've been seeing it. It can maintain your skin and give you this brownish look, this brownish skin color. If you're looking for this brownish uh, skin color, you can use Authentica to achieve that. And even some fair skin lady use Authentica. If you want to just to maintain your light skin, if you want to maintain your skin, you can also use Authentica. But if you're dark in complexion and you want to go from dark, let's say a shade lighter, you can use Authentica to achieve that. And it's also a good moisturizer. You can use it day and night, no problem. It's a very, very good moisturizer. So they give you to try. So number two on my list is Ole. Ole lotion. Ole is very very good. It's a good lotion that has been there also. It has been there for long also. And it's used to maintain the skin. You can use it to maintain your skin. You can use it to moisturize your skin. It has also healing properties. You can use it to heal your skin. If a fair person that has a damage, if you have a damaged skin, Ole can repair your skin. It will repair it if you're fair or you're using any whitening product that damaged your skin and you're looking for a lotion to restore back that skin. You can use Ole. Ole is a very, very, very nice lotion and it's also good in maintaining your complexion. If you're dark, if you're fair, if you're brown, if you're melanin, any color can use it and it's for all skin types. It does not uh, alter your color at all. It will give you even tone. It will only even tone out your skin. It will even tone your skin. So that is for only. The next on my list is um jeggings. Ah, uh, many of us know jeggings. Jeggings has also been there for long. We know jeggings. I do use jeggings sometimes, some time ago, and I have someone who is using it currently. The person is dark in complexion. If you see this person uh, dark, oh my goodness, it looks like like butter. Very, very, very good. Jeggings is very good for dark skin. If you're dark skin, you want to maintain this glowy. You know there are some dark that you see is not attractive, and there are some dark. This is they call it a black and shine. This is what jeggings will do for you. When you're dark and to be shiny, to be glitchy, when they see you from afar, the black will be glittery like this. That is what you're going to do for you. It is very, very good. So you can also give that one a try. It does not alter your skin. It does not give you any shade. You only maintain your skin tone. So the next on my list is an E45. E45 is a moisturizer. Everybody can use it and it's for all skin types. You can also use it for kids but it does not contain any harsh chemical it just it's just there it's just a normal lotion you can use to moisturize even if you're fair you can use it as your day cream like sometimes you can use it as your day cream if you're fair in complexion because you can't use any whitening uh, body cream or body lotion during the day 
go out in the sun. You can use E45 as your day cream. It will only moisturize and keep you uh, keep your skin smooth. That was E45 does moisturize your skin, keep your skin fresh and soft. You can also use this for kids because it does not contain any harsh chemical. That's for E. Next on my list is the Cetaphil. Cetaphil is a very good moisturizer which you can use to moisturize your skin for all day long. It does moisturize your skin at least 12 hours. It is very, very good for all skin type. If you want to maintain your skin color, you want to maintain that fresh looking skin, you can also use Cetaphil. And it's also recommended by dermatology. It is very, very good. You can also give it a try. If you're looking for any moisturizer that you can use, you don't want stress, you don't want anything to Apply your skin, you can use this set up. This set up is very, very, very good. You can also give it a try. The next on my list is um, CeraVe. CeraVe has been there and it has been all over YouTube. Many people are talking about it. It's a good moisturizer, though it's kind of a bit, um, a bit on the high side. It's very good. It is also recommended by a dermatologist, so you can also use that. You can also use it for kids also if you're looking for good moisturizer for kids and use a CeraVe. It is very good. It does not do anything to your skin. And you can also use it on your face. You can also use it on your face. It does not cause anything. It will just maintain your skin tone, maintain your skin color. It does not alter your skin. Let's just say it's a maintenance lotion. You can use it for maintenance. And the next on my list is a Nivea. You know, I do use Nivea. Nivea is Nivea cream. That's what I use during the day. And especially with Nivea Coco, it does give you this silky look. This silky, if you're looking for silky skin, go for Nivea Coco butter. My goodness, you will like it. And also, the scent is amazing. Sometimes I just take it and start sniffing on it because I love the perfume in that cocoa butter so Nivea is very good it's a good moisturizer it does maintain your skin I do use it sometimes as my maintenance lotion it does maintain the skin that's what I use during the day I've made a review about it before I've made a review about it before it is very very good if you don't want to alter your skin you just want to get this beautiful silky skin just go for Nivea cocoa butter so the next on my list again is also Vaseline. Vaseline cocoa butter is also like Nivea cocoa butter. They almost they are almost the same. They do the same job. So if you don't get the Nivea, you can also go for the Vaseline because they do almost the same thing. And they are very 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 good. They are very very. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, they are very very good for the skin. The thumbs up for me. If you don't see Nivea cocoa butter, go for Vaseline cocoa butter. They will moisturize your skin. They will give you a nice skin tone. You see, I'm fair and I do use it. It does not alter my skin. It only maintain my skin color. I use it during the day and at night I use my whitening lotion. So I've made a review about the lotion I'm using. But right now I'm not using anything. I'm just using uh, the Nivea for right now. Because I'm, I see that I'm a bit whiter, but now I want to just maintain this tone. So I'm using the cocoa butter, the Nivea cocoa butter for now. But later, maybe later in some months, I might change my mind and go for any other lotion. So back to the list. The next on my list is a dove. You can go for any type of dove. They have the pink, the white, different ranges. You can go for any of them. They are good moisturizer. They have been there for long. But one thing, the downside for me on dove is it makes you sweat a lot. When you use dove and go out, you, you tend to sweat a lot. It makes me sweat a lot. I don't know about other skin. But for me, I do sweat a lot. But it's very, very good. If you want to use it, you can use it during um, Hamatan. You know we have Amata in Nigeria, like winter, let's say winter time, you can use um, dough because it has a lot of different oils in it. 
it has a lot of different oil. I think that's why I'm always sweating because when the oil is too much in the lotion, it tends to sweat. So it is very, very good. It will also give you a smooth, silky skin and maintain your skin so there are some i think there are some though that you use you even get a shade light i think the pink one that pink uh, cover that pink uh, bottle when you use it you get a shade or two shade lighter so the one i use is on um, the right one and it's very big but the only thing that i did is that i don't like about it is it makes me sweat and i don't like any lotion that will make me sweat a lot i don't like it so the next on my list, the last but not the least is um, Queen Helen. Queen Helen is a good, good moisturizer. You can also use it as a base cream to lighten your skin. Some people use it as a base cream. They add a uh, different type of serum, um, oils in it for it to be a whitening lotion. But for dark skin ladies, you can use it just like that. It will maintain your skin too. Give you this brownish this brown beautiful skin tone uh, this healing healing to the water will do for you and it's a very very good lotion so we've come to the end of this video today and if you watch me to this moment please feel free to subscribe share my video like leave a beautiful comment under the comment section thank you guys for always being here for me bye